Me and personally, I've had so many hardships that I was so that at this point I feel grateful for because at this point it made me into the person I am now, which is a whole, completely better person. And I expect more hardships to help me improve further. I've had 17 total uh, um, operations or procedures to um, help me get better with, with all my medical needs. When I was about like three days old, I believe, um, I had taken a, um, a surgery that went through from the top of my brain into um, my, through my neck into my stomach. When I was born, I had an um, incision opened up in my spine where from that point, all the, fl the, the liquid from my spine drained out. So in that case, that's what mainly caused the fact that I needed the shunt in my back. My spine was looking more like an S, and then they said they wanted to um, straighten it out. And so what had happened there was they put in multiple rods and then infused it with nails. When, when I got interested in basketball, it was more like a, um, a general interest to trying to find something better to do with my time. It's definitely the thrills for me. Um, finding new challenges, especially um, meeting be people who are way better, better than me at the sport, because then I, le I, I learned so many lessons in, in the game. I think for me, it's mostly my offense. I'm, I'm one of the fastest as well. I can move past defense like, quickly, just like that. I'm also very good with shooting. Like I can shoot from almost mid range to almost three point level. I'm working on my threes, but I'm I'm getting I'm getting to the point where I, where I just need to keep improving. I see his work as an advocate for other people with disabilities, and it's an inspiration. Um, he, you know, seeing him and talking to him about his wheelchair basketball and the things that he's doing in the community has been a, a delight. Um, I know that whatever Eric puts his mind to, he, he will accomplish. Uh, he's just a, a great young man. Eric was such a leader in my class last year. Eric is a student who is committed to completing his assignments, but he's also a student who other students um, gravitate towards and they want his help. They want to ask him his opinion about all kinds of different things because they really value and appreciate him. At some point, life is gonna like beat you down like, like to a pulp. But what, it, what you really gotta know is that it's not about what hits, brings you down, it's what it's about how you get back up from those challenges. Who are the people in your life you would say have helped you the most? Definitely my parents. They've always taught me right from wrong, how it was the best way to help me approach situations. And they taught me how to regulate things with my own disability. They always taught me that it, they taught me that it was a, um, a gift from God, that um, he wouldn't have given me this disability if he thought I wouldn't be able to handle it. remembered as someone who's always tried to be a role model and try to um, be like a um, like a little light for those um, those other people who don't know how to speak for themselves.